Hello MechWarriors, how's it going? And welcome to your daily dose of MechWarrior Online where we are playing the Hunchback. I wanted to play a good old classic and we're gonna be playing the Hunchback 4H because I wanted to be a mid-line fire support and the 4H actually has some cool options that give you a good amount of DPS. However, we have to be a bit careful because of course our big side torso makes it very obvious to shoot and if we lose that thing, we lose not only our AC-10 but also three of the five medium lasers that we are running here. So we would be down to two medium lasers. So if you go for a twist and try to absorb the damage with the left side torso you would only lose three double heat sinks and one medium laser and you keep most of your firepower intact on top of that we got a bunch of quirks here that you can see here we got some ballistic stuff ballistic cooldown negative 10 percent ballistic range 20 percent we got some energy cooldown of 20 percent and energy heat of negative 15 that means we can fire so often with all of the lasers and that's really cool uh, like literally like really really cool that means over time, our Alpha Strike is not the best here, but over time we have a pretty good damage output if the enemies let us do that. So try to be kind of a support character for your bigger mechs and, and, and try to constantly lay fire into the enemy's firing lines with the fast firing AC-10, the cold medium lasers and uh, yeah, have some fun doing so. We are running 74 kph with a light engine 230, two tons of ammo, rest is heat sinks as you can see and uh, it's a lot of fun playing this mech here. But again, it's kind of squishy, it's kind of easy to take apart, so be careful careful defensive wise we were going for magazine capacity as well as all of the laser duration nodes here on the firepower tree and i try to not really maximize cooldown but get a good chunk of cooldown into it so that we can fire as often as possible also heat generation is really helpful here because it adds up on the heat gen that we have already we also went for maximum no, not maximum but the left side of the firepower the survivability tree to get some armor nodes on top of the um you know stuff that we have already trying to make the mech a little bit sturdier and i think it's worth noting that we got uh, 71 armor plates here on the right shoulder that is more than the center torso so uh, yeah utilize that as well so you know it's uh, uh it's good to amplify the quirks that you get with some uh, skill points on top of that so that you get a bigger number as a total i'm also going for a max cool run max heat containment but i think honestly after playing a few games you don't necessarily need it so instead what i would do is i would uh, drop the heat containment here completely get these three nodes and um, I would invest them into more cooldown here. So getting another cooldown point here, getting even one more here. And um, yeah, I don't know, uh, doing something like this here. Uh, this is also not needed, a speed retention down here. So that would be the build after playing a bunch of games with this loadout. The last one here is 60% rated deprivation as well as a consumable slot here. That gives us an artillery strike on top of a cool shot. A uh, cool shot is rarely needed. But um, it's good to have it, I would say. It's really good to have it. So, yeah, that's going to be the build, everybody. I wish you all a lot of fun in the two games that are coming now. If you have that, then don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And now it is time to hit the battlefield. All right, first game of the day. We are playing... Uh, what is that here? We are playing the Kenyan Network and we are playing Domination. So let's try to get things done here. This is a friend. A friend with a lot of AMS. I'm happy to see him. Also, we see the enemies already. Let's see if we can kind of... Kind of shoot them? I don't know. Do we stay here? Do we contest that? Oh my god. Yeah, it's me. It is me. It is me, the Baradu that is on the high ground. Kind of alone. Not able to contest anything here. Holy crab. All right, all right, all right, all right. So we're gonna stay here for a second. I want to help out with my AC-10. Everybody on the right side is probably gone by now. So we're gonna try to get some damage here on these Uziels and whatever they are and these Ebun Jaguars and so on. I tried to pre-fire that a bit. Oh, he was in the bag. Oh, that's why. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay. Got some damage in, but now I gotta go because I'm only target. And I don't like to be only target. Okay, the Uziel took some serious hits there. I'm looking for my UAV, but it is kind of... Uh, yeah, it's too close to us here. Because uh, UAVs have a hitbox, like this one here. And if you do something like that, you can technically drop an artillery strike on it. But this time I couldn't. Because artillery strike has already been taken. Very good strategic use of UAVs that they are doing here. Oh man, come on, let's take it down. There we go. Took us long enough. I have another one. It's important to take these. Uh, 500 meters is not really good here to shoot. But we got the second UAV as well. So it's zero and zero. Uh, okay, let's go in. Oh, not like this, Mr. Spider. Sorry. Um... Let's stay on him, actually. This Marauder is gonna go for me, right? Is he? But he should be very hot already. Let's try to take off the side torso there. Not getting all of my damage in. Oh, well done, buddy. Well done. Okay, we gotta find some other targets then. 
definitely trying to continue the, the fire here. This is not a good target. Also, I'm gonna take this artillery strike. Bam. Ba bam I gotta go. We have three kills though, so that's nice. Oh my god. Is it still going? There's yes, another hunchback. Hunchback versus hunchback. Hunchback action here. Okay, I'm gonna stay on him. Hunchbacks are squishy. I know that myself, but that's an ultra 20. Ho oh, ho ho ho! Three and two, the comeback is real! So let's stay on the high ground here. Let's try to somehow. Somehow. Okay, there's the Uziel again. There's also a Jaguar. Okay, gotta make sure that I'm not getting killed here. Uh, this is a pullback situation. This is also a cooldown situation. Team is scattered though! I hate it. Where are you going? I, I gotta pull down here. Oh 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 oh. Four and three. This. Again, it might be a turnaround. Uh. Let's get him. Yes, we got him. All right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, do I want to be here? <laughs> I don't know if I want to be here, actually. Uh, we can only shoot that, which is not much. There we go. Now we got all the laser fire. Oh, yeah, show me your back, buddy. And the front as well. This is it. Nice, we even got a kill. Six and five. Uh, I have the feeling uh, we got to go now. Because we are getting shot crazily. Uh, there's the Uziel. Man, we gotta get that guy. I'm gonna drop artillery here. Uziel is killable, Foxtrot. Let's try to get Foxtrot. I'm listening to pirate music right now. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Six and six. The again, the comeback. It might happen. There's the Warhammer. Oh god. Okay, he is busy running away. That's great. Maybe we can get some Ultras down. There is the Ultra down. I'm also stuck. Okay, here we go. Annihilator? Really? They still have an Annie? Oh, that's bad. Maybe we can disarm him a bit. Alpha, Alpha. I'm out of... I'm out of ammo. I'm just out of ammo right now. What a crazy fight, everybody. What a freaking crazy fight. Eight and seven. There's another Warhammer. He's out of weapons, though. And the uh, Annihilator is also out of weapons. So we are ahead, uh, technically. Technically. Let's go. <laughs> well done, Bowser. Didn't see that coming. Okay, and yeah, the, ba Bowser and Navid were, were somewhere. I don't know even. Holy crap, man. You were kind of hiding somewhere and then coming in and shooting into the center. <laughs> GG, everyone. Oh, I didn't see where they were. Oh, crap. Got baited here. Uh, <laughs> what a freaking game. Holy crap, but I enjoyed it a lot. We dealt 800 damage here, look at that. We got one killing blow, five assists, three KMDDs, 800 damage done, about 236 taken. That kill came quick. I need to know what he was running there. Mr. Bowser was running the Niger, all right. It's, uh, yeah, I think he had a good uh, spot on the outskirts there. And um, yeah, I, don't, I do think he's kind of playing with Navid right now. Uh, I don't know. There are some real good players on the enemy side. Yeah, Mont as well. <laughs> Crazy. Anyway, guys, that was the first round. Let's go over to the next one and see how this will go down. All right, second game of the day. We are playing the Grimplexos. We are playing uh, Skirmish here. Oh, okay, it's, an, it's another Skirmish game. So let's... Uh, okay, let's try to get things done by going into the center of the attention and uh, trying to not get hit by all of these enemies that might be setting up here already. And then they will snipe us in the face. I see a um, Mistlings. I don't know. Osiris? Couldn't really tell there. Maybe Archicheetah, something fast moving. And yeah, here we go, guys. We we have a Marauder 2C Scorch there. That would be a great battle buddy for me. Oh boy, I want to get close to him and uh, have a good time with him. You know, being his, uh, I don't know, sidekick maybe. His little little orbital orbital uh, guy that is kind of uh, flying around him and uh, shooting enemies while he is also shooting enemies. Let's see. All depends on what the Scorch's battle plan is. I mean, if he's running all LRMs, then I'm like, yeah, no, maybe not. Okay. Uh, enemies up here. Boop. Hello. Hit you. I hit you with even almost optimal range. So that was a good shot. That was about 10 damage. It's only 10. But, you know, 10 is 10 and 10 is good. So, what are we doing? I don't know. We will wait here a while. There's a guy again. And I hit him again. Ha! <laughs> Take that, Nova. Take that. Another shot out here. Man, these snapshots are coming through, really. But, uh, yeah, Nova is disengaging. Is he, though? I don't know, he's running all of the medium lasers. That mech is not sustainable. Six is the maximum, I would say, to uh, be able to, to kind of shoot medium lasers consecutively. Let's go ahead and kill him. All right, and I want to shoot. Okay, 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 okay. We can still hit him. His legs at the very least. Man, poor Nova. 
Okay, I'm gonna not push any further because I think it's too risky and here's our Scorch buddy. So, let's go ahead and, and try to get things done. I'm not blocking him, I'm gonna go behind him. I'm also not blocking him in the reverse motion. Okay, that's, that's scary. We got the kill on the Nova! Aha! <laughs> Take that, Nova! I also dropped my artillery in the same spot, so it will come down. No. And it doesn't hit anything. Uh, let's go to the other Nova here. Or is it the same Nova? I don't know. I don't know what we actually hit here. People are more or less moving to the right side. But guys, we have enemies on the left. This is too risky, right? It is... What? I hit somebody else. Who did I kill there? Also, we're gonna go left side, guys. Left side. Let's just kill them. Kill them all. Um, let's rotate left side. No? No? We can really hold this here. Uh, and get things done. Okay, he is dead. Cannot really see anything. There was a blackjack. Yeah, I'm gonna go counter rotate here. Okay, this guy might be a problem. Uh, is he even there? I don't know. I'm gonna pepper him a bit with some bullets. Oh man, it's kind of right side rotation. We could have really gotten into them here. But okay, I guess not. Okay, I'm gonna go with the team them. I don't. I'm not willing to sacrifice my mech, trying to hold the backs here. I want to be in the fight. I want to not die as well. So let's go. I'm the tail of the last car. Feels bad, honestly. Feels really bad. All right, all right, all right, all right. Here comes the murder ball. All right. So we are actually going for a light mech only. What's going on here? I mean, we have some enemies here. Hey, blackjack. Goodbye, blackjack. I think it's time to actually be aggressive. Who guys down? There's a Hellbringer. Let's not take the return fire to the to the good side. Also, let's shoot his bad side or his good side. Good. Uh, we are about to lose that side also. A bit too high there. Again, a bit too high. Um, I mean, it's a five and two scenario, and this game is extremely slow in its pace. Uh, seven and two now. Like, in its movement pace, there's no mobility involved, really. Okay, 9 and 2. We are wrecking those guys, and we have enemies just standing there. Oh, it's a disconnected Mad Dog. Oh, that's a shame. Uh, oh, well then, I guess we're gonna... We're just gonna finish the game then. Let's go. Did I miss that standing standing enemy here? Okay, here's the Hunchback. 4P. And then we have a Blood Ass on... No, wait, where's the Blood Ass? The Blood Ass got killed earlier, so we're gonna go and turn around against the Hellbringer, because it's our last target. What a weird, weird game, guys. What an extremely weird game. Okay, let's go. And down he goes. We are down to 20 shots. We still have most of our mech. Hmm, felt a bit stumpy, to be honest, but okay. I wouldn't judge here. I wanted to showcase the mech, and I think you can see that our DPS is really good. The heat management is really good. We got three KMDDs. We got one killing blow, six assists. We got 400 damage and 127 taken. All right. That was the Hunchback, everybody. That was the Hunchback with an AC-10 and five medium lasers. I hope you enjoyed the game. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.